A woman rescued from the water in New London after being stranded out there overnight. Water temperature still pretty cold too, so it was a dangerous night out there for that woman. Pretty remarkable they found her alive. News 8's Tina Detail has more on that dramatic rescue. It was here at Mitchell College Beach that the swimmer went into the water. Now we're told she's done this many times before, but her mother ended up calling police because she didn't return home for hours. <laughs> it's believed the 20 year old woman was in the water since about 8 p.m. Two and a half hours later, New London police get the missing persons call. Coast Guard crews are soon underway. A time is the enemy when you have a person in the water. Conditions were calm and there was a bright moon, but there were challenges. Of course, trying to find such a small object in such a large area, and most of her body anyways is going to be under the water. Uh, the water temp was 60 degrees last night. It may seem warm outside, but that, that water temp still could get you. The swimmer was expected to head towards these islands off of New London, but as one Coast Guardsman predicted, the tide pushed her way out there near Ledge Light, which sits at the mouth of the Thames River, where it meets Long Island Sound. Once we heard the scream, we just knelt down and grabbed her up. And Tired and cold, but otherwise okay. A coordinated effort with local police and firefighters led to the successful search, which ended after midnight. It was a sense of relief. It was. It's been kind of a tough week in Long Island Sound, and uh, so to have that one, it really picked the spirits up around the station, too. A lesson for swimmers that temperatures and tide could push them beyond their limits. Things could turn for the worse pretty quickly. Fortunately, this swimmer was wearing a wetsuit, but without it, she would have been colder and more tired a lot more quickly. In New London, Tina Detel, News 8.